Selena Gomez has come to terms with the fact she'll be battling depression and anxiety for the rest of her life. The Hands to Myself singer checked into rehab to deal with her mental health problems in 2016 and it was reported earlier in February, 18, that she had completed a two-week treatment program for depression and anxiety. The 25-year-old has now spoken to 13 Reasons Why actress Catherine Langford about her issues in a new interview for Harper's Bazaar. I've had a lot of issues with depression and anxiety, and I've been very vocal about it, but it's not something I feel I'll ever overcome, she admitted. There won't be a day when I'm like, here I am in a pretty dress, I won. I think it's a battle I'm gonna have to face for the rest of my life and I'm okay with that because I know that I'm choosing myself over anything else. However, she believes 2018 will be better than 2017, when she underwent a kidney transplant because the organs were failing as a result of her battle with lupus. Her top priority for this year is her health and well-being, which she is putting first, even if that means delaying the release of her music. I want to make sure I'm healthy, she explained. If that's good, everything else will fall into place. I don't really set goals because I don't want to be disappointed if I don't reach them, but I do want to work on my music too. My next album has been forever in the making. When people ask me why, I'm honest about it, it's because I haven't been ready. I mean, point blank, I don't feel confident enough in where my music is yet. If that takes 10 years, then it takes 10 years. I don't care. Selena, who produces suicide drama 13 Reasons Why, is the most followed star on Instagram, but she explained during the cover interview that her relationship with the platform is complex and one of my most difficult because on one hand, it empowers the star and enables her to use her voice, but it also gives her and other young people a false representation of what's important.